You guys were a crucial part of that announcement. W what do you see in terms of functionality in the watch that you don't already have on the desktop and beyond mobile? Well, I think the big difference is productivity and speed of access, right? So it's not about more functionality. It's about how quickly you can focus in on very specific functionality that's available on apps that are on your watch. So, for example, if I'm a sales manager and it's the end of the quarter, I don't want to have to keep pulling out my phone to keep approving deals. I want to just be able to glance down, tap it, and say, yeah, that's a good discount, approved. So that's the key difference. It's that you so can sales managers are actually doing that stuff at the end of the quarter. They're checking that frequently and that crazy. They need a glance to do so? Sure. The, uh, we've done some research that's about the average sales person's pulling their phone out of their pocket. The average person's pulling it out about 100, 150 times a day. So it's actually a fair bit of time that adds up, is, especially when you know that most people look at their phone not for the one thing they're looking for. They start getting distracted. They find their phone, their email. And so what uh, a watch does is keep you really focused. It, it's a glance. It's a quick movement. And that's a really big productivity improvement for sales people, for service people, for anyone on the go. Interesting. Greg, I thought that um, uh, the, the, the demo of your device, of, of your service on the watch, really wonderfully explained what invoice to go is. The notion that a, that a contractor hits the button on his wrist when he starts working as an, as an electrician in your house, and the second he leaves your house, stops it. it, it it's an intriguing location device. Why is it so much better on a watch? Well, I think it, it, the watch allows us to take it to the next level, which is currently on the phone, you have to remember to start it and stop it. And for our small businesses, cash flow is why they're using invoice to go. But if you don't remember to start the clock, you're not going to get paid. So this allows us to geofence the location. And as soon as you start on the job site, you start billing. And that makes our customers more money because they get the invoices out fully billing for all the time that they spent on site. Do you imagine that for the, the contractors and the, and, the, and the like that are doing the work, using invoice to go for the, with the watch, that that lets them go to a customer, a homeowner, or whatever, say I've hired an electrician and they want to know if they're on the job or the plumber who's on the job, it, may, it lets me know for a fact that they were there working. It gives that, that plumber, if you will, a competitive advantage? I think it absolutely does because it's for the end customer that receives the bill, we all know the more detail you can get, the more confidence you have that work was actually provided. And, and, and do you expect, therefore, the watch as a business device to be a, a kind of a, 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 a marketing tool for the service provider? I don't know if it will be as much of a marketing tool as it will allow them to access more jobs because they're going to know that they can build that job professionally. And that's something that we see in the small business segment. People want to be able to act as professional as a very big business and by, able to have, by being able to have really good invoicing, really clear estimates, all these things are enabled through smartphones. Daniel, with development, talk to me about that process with the first time out with a brand new OS. Mm -hmm. What did you guys have to put against it? Well, we've been working on wearables for over a year. I've been on the show a couple of times right. talking about Salesforce Wear. Today, or yesterday, we launched Salesforce uh, for Apple Watch. So we have three parts to that. We built an application, which is our cloud analytics app, uh, uh, the analytics cloud, that people can now personally glance at data and drill into it in a very simple, almost gamified way. We also built a developer kit. So Salesforce Wear allows people to take that Apple Watch framework and then use the Salesforce cloud platform to build amazing apps. And Without having to actually go into the the app OS or the, the software well, development tools still gonna, for the They're app. still going to use the Apple tools as well, but what you get with the Salesforce One Cloud is the biggest cloud app in the world. They get security, identity, workflow, all the things you'd need to build a business application really, really fast that people are using on our Salesforce One mobile app, and now they can extend it to the watch really quickly. It was, it was great for us. I mean, one of the things that's really interesting is less the technical challenge, although you know, managing security is important for building business apps, but it's also learning how to rebuild apps for the watch. It's not the same as taking a right, phone right. and just shrinking it down. It's rethinking how are people going to use this in a very quick, glanceable way to become more productive. Greg, I, I was surprised that you guys put your, your every company has limited resources. I was surprised you, your company put, took your limited resources and focused development on this watch. Um, it's surely good for marketing purposes. We put you on Bloomberg West. But, <laughs> but is it, you know, why did you make that choice, you, you know, and not choose to develop for other platforms that are more widely in use? Because we always believe in the small business person wanting to make themselves more efficient with technology. If there's something that invoice to go has proven, it's that small business people absolutely want to adopt these new platforms, but you have to do it in a way that's extremely practical, and in our case, helps people to make more money. And so it was a no-brainer for us to use the watch kit. 